Madam Marta Andreasen. Thank you, President. Colleagues, year after year during the last 16 years, the auditors have been refusing to clear 90% of the budget or more, and this year is no exception. They talk about errors, but the nature of the irregularities they find go far beyond that of a mistake. Suffice to say that such a situation would cause the closure of a company in the private sector and the conviction of its directors. The fact is that taxpayers' money has been unlawfully spent. This year, the auditors claim that at least £6 billion should not have been paid out. What is the essence of the problem? The lack of responsibility. Commission and auditors will, as usual, blame the Member States, but the fact is that the failure resides within the Commission due to the lack of proper controls. The Commission is in the best position to establish the rules and sanction those who breach them. But it has failed all along. And this Parliament also bears responsibility, as it has approved this situation every year and keeps asking for increase in the budget. There is no hope anymore that the EU budget will ever be cleared by the auditors. At this point, the only way to protect taxpayers' money is to reduce the EU budget drastically. Now I address the British Prime Minister, Mr Cameron, in accepting a 2.9% increase for the 2011 EU budget, you have failed dramatically. On behalf of British taxpayers, I hereby request that you lead the demand for a significant reduction of the 2011 budget. Thank you. Thank you, Madam.